here at 530. We showed you the first round of games at all three Western Divisional tournaments in our area. So now let's take a look at the night games. Start with the boys as Hamilton was taking on Whitefish in the Western A. Strong spin move from Hamilton's Austin Drake leads to a mid-range floater, cutting Whitefish's lead to four. Then a big-time block down low from Whitefish's Sam Manecki keeps the Bulldogs up by four. Then the crossover leads to the layup and one for Whitefish's Jace Kripe, putting the Bulldogs up by six late in the fourth quarter. Whitefish holds strong down the stretch for the 49-42 victory. And now let's head over to Browning versus Dillon. In this one, a shot from deep for Browning's Cash Lazy Boy gives the Indians a two-point lead in this one, 34-32 with a minute left in the first. And Dylan's Callahan Hoffman just gets the shot off to beat the buzzer, giving the Beavers a 38-34 halftime lead. Browning comes back for the 67-59 victory, outscoring Dylan 19-4 in the fourth quarter. What a game. Now over to Hamilton versus the host Ronan girls in this one. Strong drive to the hoop from Hamilton's Taryn Cyril puts the Broncos up one, 30-29 late in the third quarter. Three ball falls in for Ronan's Danielle Kaufman, tying the game at 32 all end of the third. And a nice outlet pass up to Taryn Cyril for the bucket, puts Hamilton up by four. They take control down the stretch, winning 45-37. to Now over to the number one seed Browning girls taking on the French town. Bronx, Frenchtown's Faith Rebich grabs the board, puts it in, giving the Broncos an early 5-0 lead in the first. Then nice passing. Sets up the bucket for Browning's Tamika Gardapi, cutting the Frenchtown lead to three, down 7-4 halfway through the first, and we're still waiting on that final. We'll have it online.